Long ago, the Traveler came to the Soul System. It brought a golden age to humanity. They explored, they built, they thrived. Until the collapse. A terrible calamity caused by the Traveler's oldest enemy. It brought the people of Seoul to the brink of extinction. When all hope seemed lost, the Traveler saved humanity by creating us. With the Traveler's light, ghosts and guardians together protected the last city from the forces of darkness, no matter the cost. But we soon learned even that was more complicated than we thought. Our enemies wielded the light, shaking our faith in what we once thought we knew. From old conflicts grew new alliances. And just as our enemies learned to wield the light, we found a way to leverage the darkness. In that darkness, we rediscovered the being responsible for humanity's collapse, the witness. It wishes to create what it calls the final shape. Our universe perfected in the name of salvation. Everything calcified into eternity. We've tried to follow the witness into the Traveler, and every attempt has failed. Until now. Vanguard Scout Crow wished his way inside. The paracausal bond he shares with his twin sister will guide us safely through. Now, our leaders prepare a strike force to enter the Traveler, to confront the Witness. That's our role, the tip of the spear. Every battle we fought has brought us to here and now. It's time. Is it possible? There you are. You don't know how long I've been looking for you.
witness nears the final shape. We're initiating Operation Ahamkara. Now. The Traveler cannot abate it much longer. The portal is unstable. Ikora, the Guardian. Me. I won't lose another soldier in this war. If it is, it was an honor to serve the last city with you. No signal on either vanguard leader. The Guardian's comm line is open, but non-responsive. Para, we're here. We crashed, but we're here. What is this place? The Traveler contains many more multitudes than you or I could ever comprehend. You are yet in the threshold. Whatever lies between you and the Traveler's pale heart is a side effect of the Witness's paracausal mutilations. I can feel its power stretching through the portal. I will try to buy us time. Go! Take it. The witness must be using them to search for us. That's a sphere of concentrated darkness. It's being detained in a resonance shadow. Destroy it. Ah, the darkness unraveled, and it's projecting something. An overlay of possibilities. We have taken incoming, but I'm picking up something strange with them. A concentrated source of light. Ah, we're imbued with extra light now. Let's try activating that concentration of darkness again. It worked. The light made the imagined structure solid. Made them real. Scans are inconclusive. I'm getting conflicting readings on age and material composition. Guardian, I'm not sure what that creature is. It reads like a sign, but its genetics are scrambled. Change. Agents of the Black Fleet. Nezarek, Rolk, even Callus. They were just the beginning. With you. You have to keep moving. I have not been able to reach the Vanguard. Even my bond with my brother is faint. We'll find the others. We have to. Guardian, I don't think we can win this fight. Pushing back against me, trying to exert its will over... over everything. I will hold the portal open as long as I can. The fate of all things rests on you. Guardian, hurry. When you find my brother, tell him the Allied Coalition will protect the city in the Vanguard stead. Tell him that we will join you as soon as we are able. Tell him... Tell him that I... You cling so desperately to your pain and your failures. You have lost. Let go. It saves us. It saves us. I cannot hold this any longer. There are unfathomable powers coursing through your opponent. This is not a fight you can win. Guardian, go! Go.
is this? This is... <sighs> Guardian. That vision. I think we're inside the Traveler. We've crossed the threshold. This is it. We're really here. Mara? I can't pick up anything. No comm signals from Seoul. Zavala, Ikora, do you read us? Nothing. We're alone. I... I can feel the light here. It's everywhere. Grass, the air... It's not what I expected the heart of the Traveler would be like, but it's... beautiful, isn't it? And so familiar. This is city architecture. Servants of the Witness, they must be remnants from a conquered species. There. Light and dark are colliding nearby, forming a wellspring. We can use it. Guardian, there's a wellspring of paracausal power. We can use it. Power tore right through their defenses. I know this street. I know that shop. This was the old Vanguard Command Center, but it's changed. Light and dark are welling up here. More than I've ever felt before. Feels like... like you could reach out and pull all that power to you. Control it. Could you? The line between light and dark is... it's gone. It, it's gone. Guardian, you're... you fused light and dark into harmony. How? We... we can use this. We're stronger than we've ever been. We can use this. Let's go. The transponder signal isn't far. The signal's coming from... Was intense. I think I. I need to. The traveler. It's hurting. I can feel. I feel it's. What's next? We're outmatched. We're alone. And... And... What is that noise? It's coming from over there. Uh, you gotta get better boots, Crow. I could hear you coming a mile away. Now, Aldrin, <laughs> he could sneak up on a fella. You're not Crow. Well, I'll be damned. How long has it been? A lifetime. The kid told me a few guns were on their way. Said the Vanguard would send their best. It's real good to see you two. I finally have someone to talk to about Crow's stupid haircut. Come on. I'm guessing you have questions. And I won't say I have answers. But let's talk.
I like Crow's haircut. <sighs> well, where to even start? I died. You probably remember that. Not great. Partly my fault. Lesson learned. Let's not dwell. And after that, nothing. But not a bad nothing. A peaceful nothing. I think I felt her there, too. My ghost. Sundance. She was part of me. Or I was part of her. Like we were two cards shuffled back into our deck, whole again. And then there was, oh, well, there was pain. Separation, something pulling me out. I woke up here in this body alone. No ghost, no way to use the light. And what could make this traumatic experience better than finding my killer waiting for me? But we talked it out because we're adults. He seems nicer these days. Yeah, pretty low bar, I'll admit. Because we got bigger problems, bigger, weirder problems. Crow said this was all inside the Traveler, but I already knew. It's in pain. Pain I can feel. Somebody's up in that monolith with their hand on a knife. Crow calls it the witness. And what it's doing out here has a name, too. The final shape. It's the end of everything. said it already but it is good to see you just wish it were under better circumstances it's it's good to see you too Kate I never thought hey it's all right I get it this is a lot and as much as we both want to catch up we ain't got that kind of time yet we got to get out there and find Crow I was expecting him not you and that ain't a good sign yeah yeah you're right we can save the celebrations for later Guardian, we should... Can we talk for a minute first? Just you and me? I'll give you two some privacy. Last I heard from the kid, he was out on patrol. Called in some sort of darkness anomaly. I'll scout ahead. Catch up with me when you're ready. So, Cade, I looked him over while you were talking. Scan says that's really him. There's a few readings I can't explain. He's made of light, like me, like the Traveler. Ghosts are guides, conduits for the light. Cade might not be able to wield his as a weapon, but if he's like me, maybe he can share the Traveler's light, like we do. I'm not sure. This is new. But look what else we've gained. I can feel it. The way the light flows through you. Freer. Harmonious with darkness. A full chromatic spectrum. I've only experienced something of this magnitude once before. When the Traveler created ghosts to raise guardians. When I was born. We're going to need everyone to save it from the witness. Kate's got a lead on Crow and Glint. Let's start there. Strange being back on this side of the comms, just like the good old days. Now, last transmission I got from Crow was just before you showed up. You said he and Glint were scouting ahead. 
Right. He called in some sort of anomaly, said he'd sniff around the perimeter. Personally, I prefer a little more direct approach. I ever tell you about the Hunter Vanguard before me? His name is Andal Brask. He was my mentor. Great shot. Terrible gambler. Still, we had this friendly little wager about what was inside the Traveler. I told him there's nothing. So, of course, Andal says, well, then I'm betting on everything. <laughs> everything. Ah, lucky guess. The inside is a composite of the outside. You're gonna see some things you recognize, and some things you don't. Treat it all as real. Unless it ain't. But I can guarantee you the Shadow Legion up ahead are as real as they come. The bird from our vision. That can't be a coincidence. Let's follow it. Kate, is that you? Glint! Where's the damn kid? I've been trying to raise you both on comms for hours. Gone. The hell do you mean, gone? The anomaly we were investigating, it's... a construct of darkness, I think. A, a cave mouth. It felt... wrong, like it doesn't belong here. I begged him not to go inside, but, but you know how he is. I tried to follow, I did. I did. That barrier, this place, the cave, it's... It's impossible for me to push past it all. Stay where you are. We'll find a way through. These locks control that barrier between us and Crow. Aid? Any ideas? Oh, I was never good at puzzles. It was always more a chorus thing. I think those taken scions might share a connection with that dial. That's it! Do you see any other dials in the area? Affirmative. But Guardian will handle this. Please hurry, Guardian. Crow has no one to raise him if he falls. Glint, this ain't your fault. He's my Guardian. My responsibility. And you're his. I know you want eyes on him. But you need to stay out of sight until help gets there. Kate, what do you make of that bird that led us to Glint? Well, it seems pretty obvious to me. I think it's pretty obvious to you, too. The real mystery is why nobody wants to say it out loud. I will. A traveler. It's helping us. Mess it up, Guardian! You're through! I'm coming with you. No, Glint, you hold. The Guardian will give us the all-clear. This must be it. Glint's right. This feels cancerous, like a blight, but it's different somehow. I... Uh, what is this? Bad decision. Guardian, you will thrust, thrust into, into an unending, unending life of certitude. It's in my mind, trying to tear me apart. Let us free you from this architect of your enslavement. No! Ah, I, I did it. I fought it off. Shut it out. No, no matter. matter. Our, Our voice will suffice. That diorama. We offer it to erase Prince Aldrin's stain from the Dream City. To grant Crow dominion of the Reef, the Awoken, and all the stars beyond. But he chose pain. Crow believes he is resisting temptation. As do you. But material is immaterial. Only purpose can cure his heart. And he believes his capacity for pain is that purpose. It is why he subjects himself so completely to your traveler. 
This belief is taught, conditioned into you. It can be unlearned. There, up ahead. Crow. Crow? Quiet. Listen. I've seen these veiled statues before. You have too. It's whispering something, but I can't quite make it out. Stop listening to it! I told you to wait outside. This place is... I don't know what kind of effect it's going to have on you. He's right, Glint. I don't care. He doesn't get to make those decisions for me. We're supposed to be a team. Guardian and Ghost. That's how the Traveler made us. I'm sorry. Don't ever leave me behind again. Promise. I promise. Let's set up camp outside. Kate's not far. Of course he isn't. Tell me you got the drop on him at least. You and the Guardian both need better boots. Well, maybe I'll get lucky this time. It's hard to describe. It's like... these pockets of darkness are physical manifestations of the Witness's presence here. An infection, festering. You said it spoke to you. In the dark. Tempting me. The witness knows what's in our hearts and minds. It promises to make it all real. Listen. Whatever the witness is doing to the traveler, our ghosts can feel it too. And it's spreading. Cora would know what to do. Oh, don't worry, kid. We'll find her. Even if we have to blast our way through. I don't think it's that simple. Sometimes it can be. Let's just... get our bearings again. Refocus. Agreed. What a relief to see Crow and Glint again. That cave we found him in, where the witness tried to possess me. A malignant place like that inside the Traveler feels... blasphemous. That wasn't just darkness. It was reshaped by the witness. Corrupted. No wonder it could project itself there. At least out here, the Traveler's light still protects us. As much as it can, anyway. My shell? <sighs> Don't worry. It's not as bad as it looks. The witness barely left a crack. We take hits and we get back up again. Right, Guardian? Listen, the others spotted a location nearby that resembles the Io Cradle. Sounds like something that would be of interest to a warlock we know. signal. Mara, we can barely hear you. I'll try to boost the connection. Crow? Does this reach you? She can't hear us. I'll keep trying to clean up the signal. The portal remains unstable, and your enemy has barred the way behind you. The abominations you encountered are of the witnesses making. This is but a fraction of the power it now wields. Using stolen light... It has created a new army, in opposition to the one the Traveler raised. Stewards of the final shape. No matter. The Coalition convenes to devise a method of dispelling the Witnesses' interference. Keitel and Misrax have promising theories. Once this desperate attempt to slow us is left broken, we will rejoin the attack. 
Let my voice send you now, in flight to strike down the Witness and all its followers. Go with hope, and with vengeance. I came across some wreckage when I was scouting earlier. Dismissed it as another anomaly until Ghost described Ikora's ship. No one was inside. So she's alive. We just have to find her. Yeah, and that's always easier said than done. I'm sending you some coordinates. You're on the lookout for something that resembles the cradle on Io. We'll start there. We're not the only ones looking for Ikora. The hive already bothering you? We can handle them. Well, go right ahead. I'll be here for more support. Concentrated darkness. The least we can do is put it to good use. More of the witness's abominations. Careful, Guardian. You're coming up on the coordinates of that wreckage. Any sign of Ikora? Or her ghost? Nothing yet. There! Up ahead! We know Ikora abandoned her ship. Maybe she found something. Maybe so, but going it alone isn't worth the risk. I learned that the hard way. Luckily, she's got the three sharpest hunters in the system to back her up. Oh yeah! And when do they get here? That shield creates concentrated light. You can use it to power those wells. Where light rises, darkness recedes. Sounds like you've been reading Ikora's field journals. I always try to learn from the best. More hive ahead. Eyes up. Zebu Arath's followers again. Of course they'd answer the witness's call. Well, I'm glad somebody's been paying attention. And me, I see three glowing green eyes. I open fire. And then apologize to Eris later. So, using both light and dark energy is what brought down that barrier. Mara often spoke of the balance of light and dark. We awoken, were made in conflict. Our connection to darkness is as ingrained as our connection to light. Not all Guardians are awoken, but it does feel like we all share that conflict. Commander, Guardian, I hope you are both safe and that you found Crow. I haven't been able to raise you on comms, so I cannot be certain. You know I am not one to be moved without evidence. How did you put it, Zavala? Scientific obstinance. But there is an uncanny sanctity to this place. I feel an impulse. I seek to commune with the Traveler myself. I sense if I reach out, that it will reach back. If not here, where? Find me. I'll be at the Cradle. It's just how I remember it. Stay sharp. I'm picking up a reading very similar to something Crow and I ran into shortly after we arrived. What, another charming gunslinger with roguish good looks? A high vulgar. But it definitely has your humility. We've got it on the run. Crow, how did you manage to avoid it earlier? Avoid it? <laughs> Glint, how many times did you revive me? Five? Six? Twelve? But who's counting? Not bad. Can't be efficient, be persistent. Shield! It's down. And look, light. It's creating a path forward. Guardian, I'm sensing a surge in power in both light and dark. Hey, when we find Ikora, if she's... Ikora's strong. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, that's good. Great. Um, but not really what I'm worried about. I was gonna ask if you think she's still mad at me? For what? Well, I made a promise, then I broke it. I died. Get ready, Guardian. The Witness's forces are heading your way. That's the last of them. Let's get to Ikora. We found Ikora. She's deep in meditation. If Ikora zend out, she might actually get some answers from the Traveler. Thank you, Guardian. I thought that maybe here, maybe the Traveler might give me some sort of guidance. 
thoughts at once did for the speaker. I closed my eyes and I opened my heart and mind. I think I heard it. Screaming. So did we, when we came through the portal. This place... We know. The witness infecting the Traveler. Darkness combined with light. I wish Osiris could see it. He was always ready with a hypothesis. But here's mine. The witness brought darkness into the Traveler. Everything you see here inside it is a physical manifestation of a thought made real by the light. Your thoughts. Mine. The witnesses. It plans to weaponize that light, reshaping reality outside the Traveler into a perfect stillness. A great silence, never changing, never dying. Imagine your greatest triumph, or your most profound regret, immortalized as a part of a universe where nothing exists except by the witness's consent. It chooses what your eternity will be, and imprisons you safely inside it. This is its promised salvation. This is the final shape. The Witness sees itself as the god it wishes the Traveler was. And although the Traveler resists the Witness's corruption, it and everything we know will eventually succumb. I always warn Zavala not to put all his faith in the Traveler, to save some for the rest of us. But maybe faith in the Traveler is exactly what we need. If light is powerful enough to destroy the universe, then light is powerful enough to destroy the Witness. Come back safe. Is there anyone else with you? Not Commander Zavala, I assume. This isn't quite up to his standards. Hey. I did my best, all right? Given the circumstances, I think Big Blue will forgive her. Will you? Too much? It's just too much. It's one thing for the witness to look in our hearts and minds, to conjure up our memories, but this. Hey, Cora, come on, look at me. I see you. I know this is hard. It's tough for me, too. Tough? What do you know about tough? You are always running off to play renegade. Leaving me and Zavala to shoulder all the responsibility when... When we were supposed to be a team. I know. I'm gonna make it up to you. I know you like me. Don't get ahead of yourself. You still have a lot to make up. Well then, we better get started. Ikora has always had a strong connection to the Traveler. I think that's why she's so confident. Why she's never needed the faith Zavala has. She hasn't sought guidance like this for a long time. But this place makes you reassess what faith means to you. Ikora said our memories reshape the landscape, like the ascendant plane. But here it's pure. It's not a recreation, it's a reimagining. 
That's why the witness is here. It wants to weaponize the Traveler and transform the universe into a fixed state based on what it believes we deserve. The witness thinks purpose is a static idea. Its promised salvation is a perfect ending it chooses for us. That sounds more like obsession to me. You can't bottle life. You can't pin its subtleties in place. It's wild and variable. Imperfect. Like the light, it shines out in all directions, shadows and all. Commander Zavala would agree. Come on, Guardian. We've got a fire team to reunite. Scans are conclusive. Your body is a construct of light, even if you aren't able to wield it as a weapon. Well, I guess I need my ghost to do that. Yes, but still, this is nothing short of a miracle. A miracle that can only be made possible here, in this impossible place. You sound like Zavala. Next you'll be saying that the Traveler brought me back for a reason. It did. My Cora. Give me a better explanation then. I don't have one. All I got is my hand cannon. No golden gun. No ghost. Can I ask you something deeply personal? Sure. What did you see when you died your final death? Well, that ain't fair. No, it isn't. Light. So bright, it burned me all the way up, but I didn't feel any heat. Not a lick. I didn't feel anything, actually. Not with my body, because I left that back there. These anatonauts might call it being one with the Traveler. I call it home. No pain. No fear. No vanguard paperwork. That's it. And Sundance? Oh, she was shining there too. You want to know a secret? I miss it. Even more than I miss you. So which one of us gets to play commander till we find Zavala? I'd have liked to see you try, but the Guardian will take point. House Salvation. They really believe this much in the Witness's plan? The Witness is offering them exactly what they want. An end to suffering. That seal is pyramid technology. The Witness's forces are likely nearby. Let's see if we can get the jump on them. Maybe they have a key. <laughs> that statue. We've seen these before. On the moon. Europa. The Black Garden. It shouldn't be here. Not to change the subject, but I finally got a Vanguard signal. You're welcome. Zavala needs to be our priority. Pass the telemetry through. The Traveler used its light to terraform planets, to seed life, while the Witness uses it to reshape this world in its own image. Hey, did Zavala have anything nice to say about me at my funeral? He always gave the best eulogies. No, not a word. Seriously? He wasn't there. Wouldn't come out of his office. Uh, I get it. Sometimes grief's a locked door. Not grief. Shame. House salvation again. Right on top of us. Go get him. You look to your commander for leadership, but he is made fragile by his doubts. Push him to fight the inevitable, and he will break. Let us lift the weight of suffering from his shoulders. Zavala. Cultivates a life in the shape of loss. Costs 
rendered in service to your traveler. His reward is silence. His God has nothing to give. When fallen, took his son's life. The traveler would not return it. But we can. With its light, we can do anything. And we ask for nothing in exchange. He said no. Ah. At last, his ghost speaks. Taj. You need to leave. It's not safe. Guardian, do you read us? I'm en route. Give Taj all the help you can. This is where he lived with his wife and son, isn't it? We were defending it from the Fallen. The Witness wants to wear him down to nothing, but he's still standing strong. Too stubborn to retreat. The Fallen will not defile my family's memory. Guardian, honor them with me. Defend my homestead. I think that's the last of them. There are always more. Guardian. Thank you. Just... Just give me a moment. I need... to say goodbye. I used to think... I'd give anything to bring you back. But when the witness offered me an eternity here with you, with our son, I know you understand why I refused. There are people who still need me. Soon. I'm sorry. Eyes up, Commander. It's a lie. The witness shows us what it thinks we want. And what has the Traveler shown me? <sighs> we should go.
I don't know how you're here. But... Uh, yeah, me too, big guy. Me too. And I thought we lost her when her ship went down. But she's tougher than that. She soldiered on. She... She... Losing Amanda was like losing you all over again. I'm done burying my friends. Life isn't about holding on forever. I mean, I was gone, mourned at peace, and now I'm here, opening old wounds, filling them with salt. And eventually, you have to let go. Coming together was hard for everyone. I thought it would feel right having the Vanguard back together, but Taj told me that Zavala had forgiven himself for what happened to his family, but the witness made him relive losing them. And it showed him what it would be like to have them back. It must have taken everything for the commander to refuse that offer. Nikora has concerns about his mental state. She's going to check in with him while the rest of us push closer to the Witness's monolith. Time to do some trailblazing, Guardian. Hey kid, you out there? Look, you can ignore me if you want. I would, but... You should know, I'll hold it against you. Oh, come on, Zavala's supposed to be the strong, silent one. You're supposed to be, I don't know, have figured you out yet, now that I think about it. What do you want, Cade? I want to talk about Amanda. Yeah, sure, she was a ray of sunshine on a cloudy day, but she was also the biggest pain in the ass I'd ever met. A gremlin of a kid, she tore the engine out of my sparrow when she was 12. I was furious. Almost got her booted out of the tower until I noticed she disconnected everything clean. She'd been stealing tools, manuals, whatever she could get her hands on. She practiced on scrap jump ships and junk sparrows. I guess that says something about my ride. And why she was brilliant. I told Zavala, got her a job in the hangar, and I watched her grow up. I'm sorry. No, don't apologize, dummy. Just listen to what I'm trying to tell you. Amanda lived a damn good life exactly the way she wanted to. She went out being a hero. We don't all get to do that. Some of us make stupid choices and die stupid deaths. Will you at least let me be sorry about that? Shut up. Life ain't about drawing out the living part. It's about making what you do while you're alive matter. So grow a spine and make her proud. Cade, you've known the commander a long time. You ever seen him like this? Worst I ever saw Zavala was right after the great disaster. Didn't know the light could go out of an Awoken's eyes till then. But this... This is something else. He's scared. I've never seen him scared before, not like this. I understand the fear, I feel it too, but I... I don't know what he'll do with it. Paris once told me fear is a knife. We can use it to hurt others, 
or ourselves. But we also have the choice to sheathe it. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe when we get over this mountain, we can make sure no one gets all stabby with their feelings. Got some taken popping up on my route. You all okay? Nothing I can't handle. If you need me to come over and give you a hand, let me know. Hey, now, who put who on their back when we threw them? <laughs> oh, come on. You caught me by surprise. Oh, well, I guess we're even then. Having Kay back there, it's almost like he was never gone. Like the Traveler knew it needed to make the fire team whole again. Uh, yeah, no, don't get me wrong. It's real nice to see you all again, but the Traveler could have asked before yanking a guy back to life. Cade, I need to tell you something before we go any further. Meet me up ahead. Oh, ominous and cryptic. My favorites. Yes, let's. <laughs> Was that? Oh, I felt it too, little guy. That's the traveler. The witness is digging around in its guts. It's screaming for help. Good. Here. Need backup. Girl wants to talk about how wonderful it is that the traveler brought me back. Like Ikora hasn't done enough of that already. It wasn't the traveler. It was me. I wished my way here on an Ahamkara. On an Ahamkara? The dragon that twists wishes and dreams into waking nightmares? What the hell made you think that was a good idea? We were out of options. I remember thinking that I wanted to do this because I had to make things right. And just before I took the plunge, I remember thinking about the great Kate Six. No light. No ghost, fearlessly staring up at me from the wrong side of his own gun. And there you were. And there I was. I should have told you sooner. No, no, you did the right thing keeping this between us. Ikora and Zovala can't know the truth. Not right now. They need faith. Right. And I need a drink. You go on, Guardian, we'll catch up. These Vex are followers of the Witness. It's all divisive. The same zealots from the Black Garden. I know all about the Black Garden. You sure you don't want to talk about why you're back? The why doesn't matter. Never did. Just stay focused and clear a path up the mountain. Listen, Crow, right now, I, I just need to do something that feels normal, okay? And blasting Vex feels really, really normal. Just know that the Traveler hasn't abandoned you, Cade. Even if you can't use the light, the light is still part of you. I don't think my wish could have brought you back without it. You could be capable of things you don't even realize. You know, one of the first things my ghost Sundance said to me was that I was capable of greatness. You remind me of her a little. In what way? You're both a pain in my ass. We found the next one. Must be in charge of things. Well, whatever you're doing, it's pissed off everything in the wall. Get blasting, Guardian. We'll cover your back. This reminds me of a shootout I had on Venus. Wound up stuck under a cyclops for two hours. You almost sound like you're having fun. Aren't you? Take an Invexor in retreat. Good work. I'm picking up a mess of a new energy signature. Ghost, do you feel that? I do. The Vex mind must have been obscuring it. It's this way. Hey, before we meet back up with the others, I meant what I said about keeping this wish business between us. I won't betray your trust, Cade. I know. But I gotta say it out loud. This is it. The energy signature is coming from over there. Past the cars where... where I found you. This is where I found your bones, Guardian. Where I brought you back for the first time. This is where everything started. There's an intense amount of light welling up from this fissure. That light? 
That's what it used to be like here, pure and powerful. The, the, the golden feeling you get when you're holding a winning hand, just forever. We have taken income. Guardian, let's show them what the Traveler gave us. That energy! That was... That wasn't just the light! That was the Traveler! See, Kate? The Traveler's still with us, every step of the way. Well, you weren't wrong, kid. You could just use a little tact. Guess I could too, for that matter. Maybe Ikora was right to try meditating. If we could cut through the noise... You think we can open a line of communication with the Traveler? Something like that. Listen, you and the Guardian go on ahead. I'll see what I can puzzle out. This is a sign. Something's changed in the Guardian. New power. I can feel it. The Traveler can give us all the weapons at once without a plan on how to use them. We're as good as dead. Worse. But we can't overlook the fact that it is helping us. Directly. It gave us Cade. And it's not enough. When I was... at my family's homestead, something reached out. A voice. A new voice. Calling to me. Trying to get my attention. That wasn't your wife. I know. It was a statue draped in a veil. A relic of the witness. What are you suggesting? You've seen the witness. You know what it wants to do to us. Maybe it's imprisoned others like that. No. It's a trick, Zavala. The witness is weaponizing your grief and desperation against you. What do you know about grief and desperation? Except how to turn it off. That's not fair. Listen, Commander. Cade thinks we still might be able to get insight from the Traveler. Commune with it, like Ikora was trying to. The Guardian received a vision before. Maybe they will again. Cade's out there right now, looking for a way. And when that fails... Then we'll think of something else. The Traveler chose you. Chose us. We were led here. Shown where we first met, where you rose in the light. These new powers you've been able to harness since we arrived, they're growing stronger. You have too. The Traveler is empowering us to be its champion. Zavala may be dead set on striking at the Witness, but I think Ikora is right. We have to commune with the Traveler. We have to have faith. We have to have hope. We can't let the Witness pick us apart. The fire team needs you to anchor them, like we do for each other. Let's catch up with Cade and crew and find a way to make contact. was before you. Went out in a blaze of glory? Go ahead, you can say. Wait. Did someone join our call? Guardian. We were just discussing Zavala's crisis of faith. I know you feel it too. He's wandering. Crisis? The man lives and breathes crisis, Ikora. He's having a hell of a week, but I mean, he's the commander. Our friend is hurting. The Traveler restored our family while the witness dangles the family he lost in front of him. He 
needs something valid, a reason to believe. All I know about that. Look, there's a good chance this bet doesn't pay out. I I'm not looking to get into the false hope business. All hope is false if we let it die. Please, Kate. We have to succeed. For me, for Zavala. When you put it like that, how can I say no? Crow, Kate, if you can read us, we're coming with you. What's the plan? Those big cracks we've seen? Light's been spilling out of them like an open wound. I heard something in them up in the mountain. Noises, feelings, hard, hard to explain. Kate thinks these cracks might be a vector we can use to reach out to the Traveler. Communicate with it, like Ikora was trying to. How can we help? When you were empowered by that fissure near our camp, it diminished. So we need to find more. Kate and I split up, doing some backtracking. But Glint said he felt a huge source of light somewhere near you. I couldn't figure out where it was, but maybe you'll have better luck. It's gotta be tucked away somewhere deep. Keep comms open. This place is screwy. Affirmative. Good luck out there. This material is organic. A hybrid of fungal and musculoskeletal tissue. It's spreading like a cancer through the surrounding area. Darkness. The witness is corrupting the traveler. Siphoning its light. Weakening it to the point that it can realize the final shape. Not on my watch. I think we found something. Resonant imaging shows this cave goes pretty deep toward a concentration of light. We're going to check it out. Roger, Dodger. So far, nothing out here. But when I close my eyes, clear my head, Ekora said it was like she could hear the Traveler screaming. I can feel it. I know exactly what you mean. We found one of the fissures, but the light feels like it's being strangled by something. Held back. The witness. Tightening its grip on the Traveler. Well, I ain't giving up yet. I'm gonna go check back around the Weirdo Tower, see what I can find up there. I have another deep light telemetric for you, Ghost. It's a bit of a backtrack, but it's a strong signal. Thanks, Glint. We'll check that one out next. The energy signature Glint detected is somewhere in this region, but there's no clear path. Let's see if we can find a route. If we manage to connect with the Traveler, what would you ask it? Besides how to help? Easy. I want my son dance back. It ain't fair I'm the only one who got a second chance. Whoever I was before that wish of yours pulled me out, she was there too. I think we found a passage down to the coordinates you sent me. Going in now. Be careful. There's nothing down there the Guardian can't handle. Well, you ghosts are always so worried about us, but never for yourselves. Nobody could put you back together, is there? Lucy Hive. There's Lucy Hive down here. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 hold up. You told me Sabathun's litterbugs weren't working for the witness. They aren't. I don't know how they even got here. We found the source of the light emissions, but it's being restrained like the others. I don't think it's what we need. Well, you know what they say. Third time's the charm. You heard him, Guardian. Glint has one more telemetric we can check. And if the witness has corrupted that one, too? Hey, now. No spiraling into despair. We don't have that kind of luxury. Let's rendezvous with Glint's coordinates, figure out what to do when we get there. This is the last one. Let's get looking. When we first came through the portal, we received a vision. Was it the same for you, Crow? No. What did you see? Energy. All kinds. An orchard of silver wings. Darkness infecting the Traveler. And light. So much light. It shows you what you need to see. Diametric forces your Guardian now wields in harmony. We're here. I'm picking up taken energy signatures and a powerful source of light. Could be an uncorrupted fissure. Our last opportunity to commune with the Traveler. There's a high light bearer down here. A wizard. And it's... Wait, it's... Helping us? 
it's fighting the Taken. This one is not your enemy. This one will assist you. But you must hurry. The Taken are converging on what you seek. This one is Luzaku. This one is not your enemy. What is going on? How did you get here? Infiltrated the Black Fleet at the Witch Queen's command. Drawn here when the vessel passed the threshold. The sky, the light calls to this one. The Gardener's touch is here. Brimming with life. Gardener? You mean the Traveler drew you here? Are we not all reborn for a purpose? If this is a trick... The sky is too bright here for shadows of deception. Do the gardener's bidding. This one will not interfere with its message. Kate, Crow, we're clear for you to transmat in. This fissure hasn't been infected yet. hear anything. Mind if I try? Oh! What is it? It's, uh... It's a child's voice. Are you serious? Yeah, no, it's... whispering something. Crow! Crow! Why did you murder the handsomest hunter in Seoul? <laughs> Bastard. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. You hear that? Come on, knock it off. No, I'm serious this time. No. I... <gasps> Hello? Hello? Too. Great. Maybe we can... Tenants. Hi. Sontes? Is that really you? I'm what you wanted me to be. <gasps> I don't understand. I know. You've been here before. You will be here again. You just don't remember. You can't. 
what comes from the light returns to the light. Well, what if what I want is to stay here? With you? If that's the fate you make. But you're always with me, Cade. Guardians, ghosts, the Traveler. We're all connected. We're... Devotion, bravery, sacrifice. The Guardian Tenants, I, I... I know. I... I know, I know, I heard you the first time, but you forgot one. It's... <laughs> no! 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 You don't see? touch me! Don't! Don't touch me! Don't! No. Hate, devotion, bravery, sacrifice, death. I saw her. I saw her on my Sundance. The witness kicked me out before I could get anything else. Take your time. You can tell us more when you're ready. Luzaku, thank you. What will you do now? Contemplate. Protect. Plan. This one's place is here. Defiant to the all-aged lie. We all have our purposes. You're staying to protect this place? And your kin. They attacked us. We are all our own individuals. This one cannot control them. They do as they feel is right. This one does not agree. We should get back to Zavala and Ikora and tell them what we found. Walk in the sky, Guardians. I don't know what to say. The message Cade relayed. Devotion. Bravery. Sacrifice. We all know the Guardian Creed, and the last word is death. I was hoping for more. I know you were, too. I've been turning it over in my head, trying to understand what it might mean. Cade's vision showed him what he needed to see, told him what he needed to hear, what we needed to hear. If we don't make it out of here, I want you to know that I don't regret any of it. I'm yours. And you're mine. We're all connected. His vision showed Cade that too. Nothing has ever felt more true except knowing you were my purpose when I found your bones. We're in this together, Guardian. Until the end. silent god finally speaks, demanding faith, demanding death. No. If it demanded death, then I wouldn't be here. The Traveler brought us together. That's not nothing. That's not death. I knew the moment I found you that we were made of the same stuff. Part of you called to a part of me. Nothing can break that. I've seen you at your lowest moment, when Hakim died, when you begged me to bring him back. You wanted to give up the light. You raised your gun. I'm sorry. I understood. I was grieving too. If we could get through that, then we could get through anything. Whatever you need to do, I'll be with you. Start to finish. That's what the Traveler wants from us. You keep me steady, Tarsh. But no one else can. That's what I was made for. And it's what I want to do. Let's go, Commander. You've got a mission to lead. 
Guardian. Cade and Crow scouted a number of potential paths to get us closer to the witness. They sighted a tormentor guarding this pass. Take it out, and the way should be clear. So no restraint. I want our enemy to know exactly what you're capable of. Lucent Hive? This must be the brood Ruzaki. Trapped in the pale heart with no way back. Enjoying the chaos, no doubt. Taken wizard up ahead. It's not attacking us, but I think it's a source of that sludge blocking our way. Hmm. A guard left by the witness. We're on the right track. We can't even scratch that wizard shield. We need something stronger. Something like... Like that Ahamkara skull. Resonating with Taken energy. Even the memory of an Ahamkara may have power. Tread carefully. No. Use a guardian. If it moves us forward, it's worth it. It worked. The wizard's down and the way is clear. Good work. If those Ahamkara prove to be helpful, you should look for opportunities to use them. It's not like you to encourage recklessness, Zavala. It's not like you, Ikora, to lecture on recklessness. There were other routes we could have taken. But you chose the most dangerous. Why? Isn't this the sort of risk you've always demanded I take? We should have taken a different path. One that's more direct, with fewer enemies. I know that you're angry, that you've lost faith in the Traveler. But don't let it cloud your judgment. This isn't about the Traveler. It's about hitting back hard. Ikora? Should we be worried about the pulsing Ahamkara guts in the walls? You should always be worried when there are guts in the walls. Corbin, ahead! You already know what to do. It's on the run, but we've wounded it. It won't get far. Guardian, between you and me, I like Zavala's Moxie, but this? This ain't him. Ikora's right to be worried. I got a bad feeling, too. This doesn't look like any place I've ever seen. Taken signatures! They're everywhere! Ikora, Zavala, there's a whole town down here. The architecture looks pyramidal, but it's different. Older. Something from the witness's past. Buried and abandoned in this mountain. Find out what it's hiding. But be careful. We still don't know enough about its origins. Give yourself to darkness. Only there will you find the answers you seek. Did you hear that? It spoke to us. It wants to help. Just as I told you before. Or it could be a trap. Listen to yourself, Zavala. I've known you for hundreds of years, but right now, I don't even recognize you. You just don't like it when people change. I don't like change that can cost lives. That isn't your decision to make. When we faced Savathun, you took unimaginable risks. That's enough. Focus on the mission. Get your eyes off each other's throats and put them back on that Tormentor. There's the Tormentor. Rend it apart. Looks like the Hive finally caught up to us. We did it. The way is clear. Give yourself to darkness. Only there will you find the answers you seek. This is the first concrete, actionable lead we've had since we arrived. What about Cade's vision? We should follow the path the Traveler has laid for us. How are we supposed to do that, when all it gives us is more riddles? Devotion, bravery, sacrifice. What does that even mean? I don't know, but the Traveler wants you alive. No! You do! That's what you want, Ikora. You once told me that to do nothing is cowardice. And now, you'd rather lose everything than to risk making the wrong move. But you aren't even thinking about that. You're just afraid to lose me like we lost Cade. Commander, you're out of line! Stay out of this! 
You weren't there. You don't know what happened when you died on us. You're right. I can't lose you, Zavala. Someday you will. And you'll have to learn to live with that. Excellent work. Answers are finally within our reach. Give yourself to darkness. Zavala, this is reckless. And that's coming from me. You're not just going to let him do this, are no you? No one lets me do anything. I am Vanguard Commander, and you will follow my orders. And we're your friends. We can find another way. The Traveler... The Traveler can't help us. It could never help us. I gave it everything I had. And it keeps taking. You have us. You have Kate back. Your fire team. That's not enough. Bad news. The commander's left camp alone without his ghost. Tarj needs our help tracking him down. Zavala believes he'll find the witness's weakness by giving himself to darkness. We knew what the risks were when we came here. That we might not all make it back out. Zavala better than anyone. I know he's trying to protect us by going alone. It's why he left Tarj behind. He pretends he's dismissed Cade's vision, but we've both seen what's behind his eyes. Zavala is ready to embrace his final death, just for a chance to destroy the Witness. He needs us. There's a storm gathering. You can feel it in the air. The closer we get to the monolith, the more powerful the Witness's influence becomes. It's interfering with my ability to track the Commander. And he won't respond when I hail him. A look in his eyes when he turned away from me. I don't know what he plans to do. He won't let anything stop him. Copy that. We'll need to move fast. Cade? Saw so you stand up to the Commander back there, kid. That took guts. Let's go. Ikora's not coming? No, nope. it's you and me. You can't blame her. Tarj, what did Zavala say when he left? I'm going for a walk. Walk after them. Guardian, you join up with Tarj, Kate and I will bring up the rear. Take down anything that's standing between Zavala and his ghost. I've got an idea, if you'll humor me. The statue that implored Zavala to give himself to darkness. There are more of them. All over this place. You think you can get them to talk? They'll speak up if they have something to say. That's what I do. Come on, let's establish a rapport. Look me in the eye and speak truth. Where is he? We know he came this way. Your commander seeks our witness. But without you, he will become one among its many. What the hell does that mean? Did you do something to him? Those who have not yet been called from the Collective will guide him. We who have been bound will lead you. You must break through. So is that an offer to help? Hello? Pointing to our doom. Let's go. That storm. It's building. Growing stronger. Good. If the Witness doesn't want us to come this way, it means we're on the right track. We who have been bound. It sounds like those statues are prisoners of the Witness, just as Zavala believed. I hope he feels vindicated. The statue said that Zavala will become one among its many. Is that a threat or a warning? We'll need to find another. Judging by the guards, our next contact is in here. You want to help us find Zavala? Fine. But it's your fault we're in this mess. 
Why did you reach out to him in the first place? Our voices are many, but our voices are weak. It's too bright here. Give yourself to darkness. In darkness, our voices will be heard. Do you think we can trust them? Any sign of the commander? Ikora, you came. Of course I came. It's my fire team. And a fire team's a family. No sign of Zavala yet. But he was right about the statues. They're trying to help us. I've had enough of this. Commander, come in. Commander, answer your comms now. This is the last time I let him walk away from me. The last statue said they can only speak to us in darkness. That makes me think they still have some connection to the witness. Something that's made up of a million individuals is bound to have a few dissenting voices. We are the shame our witness could not bear to reckon with. So the first knife cut us out. Exile until we are deemed worthy. Imprisoned until we can be reintegrated into the final shape. You were once part of the witness. Can you just tell us how to defeat it? We are bound. There is no other way but to give yourself to darkness. Give yourself to darkness and see. Your commander needs you in the light. You will set us free. You will set us all free. Why would the witness imprison its own like this? The witness seeks to control what it can change, and to change what it can't control. That's the purpose of the final shape. It's afraid. You couldn't have stopped him, Taj. True. Zavala can't be stopped by much. But he is my commander. I watch out for him. I raise him when he falls. And a guardian run a mock about what happens. Is he an audience with something that punched a hole in the Traveler? If you could just tell us how to free you. We're not strong enough to aid you. Your journey is close to an end. No, we are not strong enough. We're not strong enough. I don't think any of us are strong enough to do this alone. Unfortunately, Zavala forgot that when he left without me. But that's why I'm here. To remind him. I'm sensing a surge of energy that I can't pinpoint Zavala's location. It's probably more interference. Just concentrate on him. I can't. You can. Just feel for his life. I can't. Tarsh, it, it's okay if you can't find Zavala. We're past the storm, but something could still be throwing off the signal. Even if that isn't the case, you don't have to know your guardian by his light. And how would you feel? Were you in my shell? You scour the earth for years, hunting on me, feeling, growing lonely, losing faith, but eventually, miraculously, finding your mark. And you spend years more by his side. Watching him fight and die, fall in love, lose himself to grief. You forge a bond, seal your fates, and yet you are not sure if you can do the only thing you were made to do for the one person you were meant for? How would you feel? Well, well I... Forget it. The feeling doesn't matter. You take the closer source. I'll check the one ahead. I know what to do. We got your back, buddy. Ghost, Guardian, keep looking. We'll catch up with Taj. Our signal is coming from another one of the Traveler's gifts. But Zavala's not here. Vanguard, have you found him? Not yet. This place is falling apart. We gotta move. Guardian, Taj has a lock on the Commander. Hurry!
this. is nothing, Zavala. You're still our friend. You're still our commander. It changes everything. I have no light. No purpose. No ghost. I know you want to blame yourself, but... Tars knew what he was getting into. Don't! Please. to pay any cost. I was. Not Taj. He was devoted. He was brave. And part of me resented him for that. Sometimes I wished he would just... Leave me. He did what ghosts are supposed to do, right? He recruited you for a war. And he chose to sacrifice himself so you could end it. 
abandoned? How? I threw away my light for a riddle and a memory. A memory that can save us all of the witness becoming what it is. What was made can be unmade. Right, right. Oh, we, we gotta link up with those defector specters again. The place they showed me. It's here. The witness's memories became manifest too. I can guide us. But uh, I'll need help. We can do that. Alrighty then. We keep our momentum and Zavala gets to focus on something that's not... You know, we ask a lot of our ghosts. And they don't get one second chance, much less a million that we do. Just wish I'd thank my gal Sundance back when I could. But she knew I appreciated her. At least I hope. was the kind of ghost I thought I ought to be. There's no manual on how to do what we do, but Tarj always knew the right answer. He was dedicated, dutiful, and he knew Zavala better than Zavala knows himself. I want to believe that his light has returned to the Traveler like Sundance's did. Like mine will, someday. Tarj is gone. Zavala is mortal, but their sacrifice can't be for nothing. We have to go to the memory of the place where the witness made itself, so we can learn how to unmake it. It's here, in the Pale Heart. I have faith in us. The Traveler has faith in us. And now, thanks to Tarj, we have a chance. The Witness's defector spoke of a ritual site. The place where they destroyed themselves. Where the Witness was created. Yes. Zavala thinks he can navigate us to it. Guardian, you lead. We'll follow. Zavala no longer has his light. But I do have my gun. Reaching the ritual site is our top priority. Do not let your focus stray. Hey, this is a secure line. How's the commander? Commanding. We've already got resistance. This won't be... Your, Your search, search for purpose, purpose continues. Once more, it leads you to us. What is it you seek? Your endless pursuit of us means you nothing. We've got a taken blockade ahead. We're getting an influx of hive back here. Clear them out. The witness knows there are descending voices within it. It'll stop at nothing to keep us from reaching the ritual site. We're still working over here. Keep moving. Assist. You wish to aid your traveler with reckless abandon. To spread the futile poison of life. Chaos disguised as freedom. We deny this pain. Let us enlighten you. That riddle. What was made can be unmade. I can't get it out of my head. How are we supposed to unmake the witness? The same way that the witness plans to remake the universe. The Traveler's Light 
Light restores, terraforms, shapes. We could use it to break the witness apart. Destroy it. There's resonance energy coming from that doorway. There has to be some way past it. I was powerless when I stood before the witness. When I confronted it in that place. But Guardian, your ability to wield both darkness and light gives you an advantage. You will do what I could not. Forsake the architect of your enslavement. Cast aside your squandered loyalties. You are no longer a pawn of the light. Be free. We've got hive knights incoming. But light bearers of soul. In truth, you seek not hope, but endless challenge. This ambition is known to us. Teaches that what cannot be destroyed will surpass infinity. The hive were lost to this childish game. Too obsessed by the violence of the first knife to see the final carving. Are you not also a prisoner of this eternal chase? For all your power, you destroy to receive glittering rewards, the commendations of your peers, triumphant accolades for all to see. We offer you an escape. Embrace this truth. Be uplifted, triumphant against Entropy. Sounds like the witness thinks you're hot stuff. It flattered me too. It offered me the awoken throne. A kingdom all my own. My sister's love. How is your sister? On her way with the helm. Mara? You're in danger, brother. And you're supposed to be with the Coalition fleet on the other side of the portal. I know. Mara, don't be stupid. Now you know how it feels. Accept all that you are owed. Be adorned. I really don't like the look of these rooms. Guardian, that looks like the old Vanguard war table. Light bearer, these, these meager, meager pawns you allow to lead you. Their strength pales in comparison to your own. They hold you back from all that you could become. We judged humanity before you made your greatness known. Your worth, your might. You deserve power, more than your traveler would ever grace you with. Join us, not as part of the final shape, but as a god. Taj was right. Silence, you insolent speck. A disciple. You wouldn't make that offer unless you were truly desperate. 
terrified of us, of what the Guardian can now do. You seek the place we destroyed ours. Come. And be destroyed. Hey, what the hell happened in there? The line went dead. The witness. This is the place Zavala described. Fire team, we're here. It's quiet. Feels like a tomb. Stagnant. And there, at the center. The place where the witness was made. Give yourself to darkness, Guardian. But stay vigilant. Stay alive. Simultaneously victims and perpetrators, condemned to fade in light, as all things do. And so we reshaped ourselves to become this purpose the universe lacked. We lost ourselves there. Destroy us! Something's happening to the air here, Guardian. Be careful. Another subjugator. We're just outside the ritual site, but keep at it. We'll hold the line and keep everything we can from spilling in. Vanguard, we figured it out. What was made in darkness can be unmade in darkness. And in darkness, the statues are still part of the witness. Destroying them will destroy the witness. Ghost, you two need to get back in there. Guardian, that sword. The light forgets. The light forgives. In memory, we remain. But in light, we are freed. The light will tear us. The light will rend mind from mind. Split what has become the vile one. Into the repentant thing. Destroy us. Whatever you're doing, it's working. Guardian, you must return to the dark. Your gardener cannot help. While in prison. Free it. It will take all you have and more to unmake that which has been made in the darkness. Destroy us. We cut you out! <laughs> Get out of there, now! The witness is regrouping, but we'll keep it off you. Cora, be brave. Keep going. Keep going. 
attacking party. I've got a lock on your position. I'm bringing you up. not yet lost. The witness may have won this battle, but it is wounded. And while you've been occupied here within the Traveler's heart, I've brought our allies to help you land the final blow. The full might of Keitel's empire stands behind us in this endeavor. Mizrax Kel rallies his House of Light to save their great machine. And I have found a guardian of great renown, Micah Tim, who comes to us with bold ideas. If you intend to subdue the Witness, we must first fight its corruption and weaken its hold on the Traveler. You will grow in strength, in power, and when the Reckoning is at last upon us, you will storm the Witness's monolith and strike where it is most vulnerable. You will shatter its hold on the Traveler. And you will end it. the witness. I... I didn't think I'd ever be able to say those words. We can use your affinity with darkness to navigate it and seek out the witness where it's most vulnerable. And we'll channel the Traveler's light to destroy it from within. But first, we have to loosen the witness's hold on the Traveler. We aren't strong enough without its full power behind us. Our allies are here now. 
They'll help us ready ourselves to strike against the witness and sever its connection to the traveler. This is it, Guardian. I know I'm in rough shape, but I'm not afraid. This is what I was made for. Whatever it takes. <laughs> <laughs>